The Fiend and Alexa Bliss are not only one of the top storylines and pairing in WWE, but it has actually made Raw watchable these last couple of weeks. I mean, bro, seriously. Raw has been terrible, and people saying it all over Twitter all the time, that Alexa Bliss and Bray Wyatt are the only good things on, on Raw, aside from Drew McIntyre. I just wanted to talk about how great this pairing is because I'm pretty sure people just don't realize how great they are. My name is I King Skies, and this is the greatness of Alexa Bliss and Bray Wyatt. And if you like this video and you have a mother, hit that like button and subscribe. So without further ado, hmm, play my intro. True. I am the stone. Now, I think the number one reason why Alexa Bliss and Bray Wyatt are so over and great is because they are different from the other people on the Raw roster. Not only that, but the booking is done by Bray Wyatt himself, so being trashed by Vince's booking isn't possible. Alexa Bliss and Bray Wyatt are often so different from the segments on Raw that it almost shines a light on their segments. And it gives them more of a boost because I don't know about you guys, but after Alexa Bliss and The Fiend are done, it's pretty much the Drew McIntyre show. I'm looking for Drew McIntyre. Or if it's the other way, Drew McIntyre comes first and I'm looking for The Fiend and Alexa Bliss. Everything else is just pretty much dry, not to say the least. And it's not, it's, it's, it's very different, if you know what I mean. The booking is so good and the promos actually make sense they target people who hurt them in the past or wrestlers who have the belt they don't attack them just because their name is lana and they try to smash them through the announce table every day the reason why alexa bliss and the fiend are so great is they're flexible no i do not mean the tiana trump in that one video flexible i mean the flexible as they can do just about anything. They are such a gold mine in that they don't need the championship in order to make them a real threat and get over. They don't need to be in a high end feud to draw views either because their characters and storylines is already enough to make people tune in. It's just beautiful of how so many good feuds can come out of this pairing. I mean, if you look back at the Undertaker, the Kane, those are characters that don't really need the championship or be an eye infused to be over or be paid attention to. Undertaker is a prime example of this. He has made a career, a Hall of Fame career, and he's only held the belt like what? I want to say four or five times. I mean, I'm not really sure, but Undertaker is a Hall of Famer and he's probably one of the greatest wrestlers of all time and he hasn't really held the belt like that. Bliss versus Ronda can happen. Bray versus Randy Orton is already happening. Just some good feuds that can happen and you'll... The third and final reason why The Fiend and Alexa Bliss is so good is everything outside of the matches. So basically, the Firefly Funhouse and the lore of this pairing. If you go back to... Bray Wyatt versus John Cena, well, The Fiend versus John Cena. After the match, <laughs> John Cena posts everything about The Fiend, and it just had people speculating. And if you pay attention to it, people are going to be looking when John Cena returns, because not only that, but they'll be looking to see if The Fiend actually hurt John Cena, if The Fiend actually changed John Cena. That is views and that is viewership going up right there you know when alexa bliss was first starting you didn't know whether she would join the fiend or not until she started going crazy 
Bray Wyatt is so good in investing you in the story before the big thing happens. So when it does happen, like Bray turning into the Fiend or even Alexa joining the Fiend, you can't wait to find out what happens next. He uses things like Twitter and Instagram to fully extend and make everybody wonder what's going to happen next. This is why The Fiend is so great because when he does deliver the best content, all eyes are on him. And that is why The Fiend and Alexa Bliss are so great because when everybody is watching, they put on their best suit, they put on their best acting skills, especially Alexa, and they go for it. They are not afraid to invest into these characters. And it makes everybody have something relatable because they're like these villains, but you like these villains. It's like, it's just like Alexa Bliss with Harley Quinn. Everybody knows Harley Quinn is a bad person, but they, they see good in their eyes because they like Harley Quinn and they like her characteristics and everything like that. Same thing that goes for Alexa and same thing that goes with um, The Fiend. He's a villain, but we all like him and care for him. They are probably one of the most different and and unique wrestlers I've ever seen. And that is definitely a compliment because we have had so many wrestlers in this time. And for him to create and go back after his career was dead and create this was such a brilliant idea. And that is why... They are so great. My name is I King Sky. So if you like this video, like and subscribe. And thanks for watching. He's acting the same. Screaming we're older. These niggas is pain. I am the hero, man. I got them by chain. Shuffling on the ass like I'm the new king. Passing these missions like life is all easy. Screaming to the mic like my name is.